Okay, what we have here is a, uh, there was a search warrant that was issued to the Mascouche police. Uh, they went to 3905 Monte Masson. Uh, they were looking for uh, stolen uh, Kubota vehicles. Uh, usually these type of vehicles are construction vehicles, whether they're, they, they, they go to transport uh, earth or gravel. Uh, so once the, they went in, uh, they found what they were looking for, but uh, much to their surprise, uh, the, during the search warrant, uh, they also found uh, this machine here, this contraption. Uh, this machine, basically what it does is it makes pills. Uh, now this is a clandestine uh, pill making operation, it's uh, totally illegal. Uh, this machine here in particular, uh, if you notice the disc that we have here, uh, it, had, it makes uh, 36 pills. What we usually found by uh, what we got from our experts is uh, the machine itself makes 24. This one here makes 36, which can produce a lot more pills. Now we're talking whether it's ecstasy or whether it's speed, this machine can produce a lot more. Now what we also have, this machine here, uh, at top speed can make uh, approximately 3,000 pills per minute. Uh, it's important to note, uh, you can reduce the speed of the machine, you can make 1,000 per minute. Uh, you can also bring it down to apparently 500 per minute, which is still a big amount. Uh, what's also important to note is that uh, each one of these pills are sold on the market uh, at roughly $15 per pill. So we do the calculations, 3,000 times 15, that's quite a bit of money. Uh, if you would like to go on the other side, I can show you slowly how it works. So basically what you have is uh, an electric motor that's uh, plugged into uh, an electrical outlet at uh, 240 amperes. And what happens is, if you can take note, it, uh, you've got the funnels here that are, are filled up with the powder or uh, the, 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 the compound that they use to make them. And once it's inserted in the machine, I'll turn it by hand. You can see the machine, just uh, the powder goes in there and it takes the shape of the pill. In this case, we have uh, a tulip shaped pill. Uh, it's fairly new on the market. We're still trying to get uh, uh, to know where exactly it comes from and who this tulip shaped pill comes from. We've also seen in the past uh, what, we have, what we know as a, uh, a, the, the Superman S type pill. This one here in particular is the tulip. Now, as you can see, as we turn the machine, it's punched into the form of the tulip. It's ejected. It comes down the ramp here. There's another adapter that comes down. And then it falls into this other machine here where the pills fall in this box. There's uh, kind of like a, a grill, if you will, that vibrates at the high speed. Uh, the vibration loosens any excess powder that's on the pills. And the pills go in a, in a box and the excess uh, powder goes back into the original box where they can reproduce more pills. We have here what was seized on the scene. Uh, we're talking roughly 21 kilos of uh, white powder. Uh, this powder here will be sent to uh, Health Canada where it will be analyzed and they'll tell us exactly what it is. Uh, it's a fairly large amount. Uh, you also have some in the uh, little transparent bag right behind you. Uh, once again, these are uh, the punches that basically make the shape of the pill. If you can notice once again, uh, you got the shape of the tulip. Uh, like I said, it's fairly uh, new on the market. We're very curious to find out uh, who owns this, uh, this product and where it comes from. Uh, we all know that uh, these type of pills, the quality is it's basically it's garbage. But what I also want to show you is uh, the machine itself. Now, uh, if you take a closer look here, this is where the powder goes in and it, it compresses the, the, the powder into the pill. Now, once it comes out this way, if you take a closer look, you've got the white powder, okay, but you've also got white grease and oil. That's all mixed up in these pills. So this is basically what you're ingesting. Uh, we're we're going to find out uh, through the analysis what's in the powder, but you also got the grease. If you have any information, you can call uh, us here at the Laval Police Department. Uh, all uh, information will be uh, confidential, uh, and you have nothing to worry about. Yes.